Hey everybody, welcome back. We're on supply and we got a video called Supply, Shifting Left and Right. Now, for some of us, we're like, hey, I got this. Supply shifts right, it's an increase in supply. Supply shifts left, it's a decrease in supply. And for some of us, you know, that's great, that's good. But here at Ecom Busters, we want you to understand this deeply, okay? We're gonna explain to you why we say that supply and demand, both of those curves actually, shift left and right, okay? And it's all about independent and dependent variables. Now, don't get nervous, okay? Just hang with me through this video. Hopefully, it's gonna make a ton of sense to you. Let's go over to math class, okay? If we head over to math class, we've got Y on the vertical, very typical, X on the horizontal, and the Y is the dependent variable, okay? Actually, let me make, make sure that comes out a little bit clearer. The Y is the dependent variable, and the X is the independent variable. So, if you see, let's say, the following functions, a Y sub zero and a Y sub one, and you're asked, what happened to the function? What happened to Y? Well, what should you say? You should say y increased, okay? This function increased. Y, the dependent variable, measured vertically, increased at all values of x. Let me say that again, because here's the key. Y is dependent on x, and what we're saying in this thing is the dependent variable has increased at all values of x. So when you look at that in math class, you say, hey, that thing shifted up. Y got bigger, and that is exactly right. But now we go to econ. Econ, we got price on the vertical. That's the independent variable. We got quantity supplied over here on horizontal. That's the dependent. And let's say you see the following two graphs, S sub zero, S sub one. And you're asked, what happened to supply? Now remember, look over here, Y sub zero, Y sub one. Uh, y increased in the math class. Absolutely right, curve shifted up. What happened here? What did supply do? Did it increase? Did it decrease? Supply decreased. Why did it decrease? Why are we saying that? Well, what's the definition of a decrease in supply? A decrease in supply is a situation where the quantity supplied measured on the horizontal axis, the dependent variable on the horizontal axis, the quantity supplied is decreasing at every single price point. So we've got a decrease in the quantity supplied every single price point. Decrease in supply, it's shifting left. Here's the thing, guys. When you talk about a curve shifting, whether it's shifting up and down or left and right, it's all about what the dependent variable is doing in relation to the independent variable. By embracing the fact that the quantity supplied is the dependent variable and price is the independent variable, you're gonna understand why we're talking about left and right shifts. When curves shift right, we're getting more dependent at every independent. When curves shift left, we're getting less dependent variable, a less amount of that dependent variable at every single independent variable. And that's why in economics, supply and demand shift left and right, because the economist has switched where the independent and dependent variable go. Hopefully that made some sense to you and hopefully that gives you a little deeper understanding of why when you talk about supply and demand, think left and right, don't think up and down. See you in the next video.